Hi, my name is Danica Littlechild. I'm from Muscochise, Alberta, Neosquiac, which is also known as Urban Skin Creation. I am a lawyer working and living in my community, and I'm also consulting legal counsel with International Indian Treaty Council. Many leaders are sort of being pressured um, to become consumers of water versus people who are protectors of water. So the aspiration of the mainstream system is that we basically assimilate and become like everybody else. Everybody else pay fees for their water. They don't really think about where that water comes from. Here in Winnipeg, obviously it's a big story. It comes from Shoal Lake and the nation there can't drink their water and yet all these people in this municipality you know, benefit from the appropriation of that resource. And so if you think about what does this sort of incrementalist approach mean, if it continues to happen, it potentially means that the best that we can achieve is to sort of be like everybody else. You know, we're sort of told, well, check your treaty rights at the door, check your identity at the door, then you can come in the room and be equal. I think, you know, part of it is sort of being willing to be critical thinkers about the system and solutions that we're being presented with um, and being willing and being brave to oppose them when they need to be opposed and also being willing to be brave enough to be in those rooms to vocally oppose them as well.